The Learning Pit is a way to engage students in thinking about challenge, thinking about what they're doing with their learning and where they are in the process. I created the pit because I wanted my students to know that it's okay to be out of their comfort zone. In fact, it's better than okay. It's preferable to be out of your comfort zone because that's where you learn. If you stay within your comfort zone, if you're doing things you can already do, there is very little learning that takes place. But if you step out of your comfort zone, if you explore, if you ask questions, if you investigate, that's when learning takes place. And so I talked to my students about Vygotsky's zone of proximal development. I talked about Piaget's next level, but it didn't really seem to chime very well. So I created the learning pit, the idea that you start with a, an idea um, that seems to be straightforward, and then you challenge those ideas and cause people to go into the pit. That is where they are more challenged, that's where they are thinking more, that's where they're confused, that's where they have to work harder to make sense of those ideas. And then as they make sense of those ideas, they come out of the pit with a greater sense of understanding. Now, of course, you need a growth mindset to do that. Is also, the more you do that, the more you get into a growth mindset. So it's a bit chicken or egg in that situation. I'm delighted that the, uh, my new book, Learning Challenge, all about how to guide students through the learning pit, is going to be out in Dutch very soon. This is what it's going to look like. I hope you'll find it useful to challenge yourself as a teacher, as a leader, also to challenge your students so that we engage them and they can learn more. Thank you.